tuning in to this update here on CBSBoston.com. I'm Katie Brace. And I'm Ken McLeod. Here are some of the stories making news. Police are searching for a suspect in a fatal shooting in Dorchester. Officers say a man was shot dead while sitting in his car near Evans and Morton Streets around 4 o'clock yesterday afternoon. Police tell us they do not believe this was a random act. Boston police are also looking for the gunman in a deadly shooting from Friday in Dorchester. In Holbrook, a suspect has been arrested in connection with a home break in. State police releasing this video of officers tracking down a suspect from the sky. Troopers used a thermal imaging camera on board their helicopter. Officers say the suspect had broken into a home on Hamilton Way. With the help of that camera, they were able to corner him and take him into custody. State Senate could vote as early as this week on a bill regulating short term rentals like Airbnb. Under the Senate plan, rented rooms would be subject to the state hotel tax and local excise taxes. The House passed a different bill with tiered tax rates for individuals, professional property management groups, and investors. The Senate says its plan would generate more than $34 million in state taxes and more than $25 million in local taxes every year. Well, you may not want to hear it, but snow is on the way. Here Not in an April Fool's joke. As meteorologist no. Pamela Gardner tells us, no need really to head to the store for all that bread and milk. No, this is a quick moving system and it'll get out of here by late Monday. Monday morning, waking up to mostly dry conditions if you have a really early morning commute. It's 6 o'clock, 7 a.m., you're looking okay. But then the center of low pressure passes to our south and brings in the snow chance. We're on the north side of the system, so colder air will dominate here. Temperatures around freezing, but a few spots will stay in the mid 30s. It's going to be a wet and pasty snow consistent. At the height of the storm between 8 a.m. and 11 a.m., we could see one inch per hour snowfall rates. And we do have some tricky tra travel spots, especially across the south coast, as we see the deeper blues indicating the heavier snowfall rates. After noon on Monday, temperatures slowly go up and the snow slowly moves out. So most of the accumulation is going to be on the grassy areas, not so much on the roads unless you're along the south coast. That's where you can see isolated three inches of snow accumulation till about 2 o'clock, coating to Two inches widespread all across Massachusetts, including here in Boston. But all that's going to melt away as temperatures tomorrow afternoon will be in the 40s and eventually clearing skies by late in the day. Here's a seven day. We have a chance for some late rain Tuesday, 45. We go up to 68 degrees on Wednesday and a chance for some scattered thunderstorms, cooling us off to 44 degrees for opening day for the Red Sox. Ken, Katie? Ah, all right, Pamela, thanks. And that does it for this update here on CBSBoston.com. We thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great day.